I have created an AI-generated animation series without any prior experience in animation. In this video, I will demonstrate the four simple steps that enabled me to bring this series to life. And the best part? You can do the same using free tools only. Well, gentlemen, you have my curiosity. But before we dive into the process, let me share how I came up with the idea for this video. There I was. As always in my nightly routine binge watching my favorite YouTube channel, My Story Animated. Oh, the joy of witnessing those wild tales unfold, where teenage characters find themselves in school drama, and the challenges of teenage love. It's like a chaotic battlefield where teenagers are caught in the middle of an ongoing war between hormones and heartbreak. They become unintentional victims, affected by the intense emotions and vulnerability that come with teenage love. In this struggle, their hearts bear the scars of battles fought and lost. Hmm. This takes me back to me and my ex in the good old days. How relatable. However, moving on, something caught my eye. Each of these videos gets multiple millions of views. And not after a few years, no, within a week. Of course, being the money-hungry wolf I am, I couldn't resist checking Social Blade to see the numbers. And perhaps, maybe I stumbled upon the holy grail of YouTube stats because this channel is making nearly $1 million every month. That's it. I'm going to create my own animated videos. But in true AI apocalypse fashion, I'm going to do it with AI. Let's dive right in. For our AI animation, we'll be using Adobe Express Animate Video, a free animation tool provided by Adobe AI that allows you to generate animations based on an MP3 file. It analyzes the file to determine the spoken content and creates a lip sync animation to match the speech and the desired emotional response. Click on Make Your Animation to get started. Within the tool, you have the option to choose from various characters and place them in different parts of the screen. You can scale them, change the background, and even record your own voice directly or import, for instance, a pre-recorded speech you created using an AI voice generator. Once you upload the file, you'll have something like this. Welcome to AI Apocalypse, where we dive into the fascinating world of artificial intelligence. Well, that was anticlimactic. Now hold on, I know what you're thinking. It may not seem impressive at first, but let me change that perception. Let's head over to ChatGPT and write a script for a short comedy animation. My plan is to create a humorous dialogue between a father and son. And I have to say, ChatGPT has given me an actual masterpiece. But I don't want to spoil the result. You'll have to wait until the end when I show you the final outcome. But let me tell you, you are going to like this. However, let me briefly talk you through the steps I took for ChatGPT to create this. I asked ChatGPT to provide me with a joke involving a father and son. I asked to give the father and son a name. Then. I requested it to expand upon the joke to make it more suitable for a short animation. I also instructed it to add an intro and outro. And last but not least, I asked ChatGPT to give the animation show an amazing and super creative name. Well, I think the creativity ran out at this point. Moving on, we'll use an AI-powered text-to-speech generator. Personally, I highly recommend Muref.ai. It's a widely acclaimed tool with several awards and offers over 120 voices in 20 languages. By selecting the character's head, you can change the voice. For my animation, I'm looking for three distinct voices, a narrator, the son, and the father. Let's start with the introduction I created in ChatGPT and see how it sounds. Welcome back to the Dad and Son Show. In this episode you will see Ethan, the son, try to tell his dad, Gary, a special secret. And oh boy, is he in for a treat. One of the features I really like is the control it provides over the voice. In Muref itself you can adjust the pitch, which changes the tone's height and the speed of the voice. For the narration, I'd like the voice to be slightly deeper and speak a bit faster. So, I'll lower the pitch and increase the speed. Let's have a listen. 
Welcome back to the Dad and Son Show. In this episode you will see Ethan, the son, try to tell his dad, Gary, a special secret. And oh boy, is he in for a treat. Now we're getting somewhere. Another amazing feature is the ability to add pauses in the speech. As we all know, in comedy, timing is probably even more important than the joke itself. To add pauses, simply select add pause and choose the desired length. Now let's move on to the son's voice. If you want to add another voice, you need to select add a block, then choose the person's head and the desired voice. I'm looking for a voice that resembles a teenager. Let's paste the next part of the script I made in ChatGPT and have a listen. Um, dad? Dad? I, um... I think we can do better. Let's make the voice higher by changing the pitch. And again, let's have a listen. Um, dad? Dad? I, um... As if his coconuts magically disappeared. I want to make it a bit slower. And let's add some pauses. Now for the father. Again, paste in the right part of the script from ChatGPT. Here, you can also see the power of Nira. It can even make humming sounds. Hmm? That is very impressive. Let's make the voice a little deeper and very slow to get the real uninterested dad experience. Hmm? That is what I'm talking about. All right. I'm going to continue doing this for the rest of the script. As you might have noticed, I was showing you this in the trial version. It is important to know that if you want to download the audio, you will have to go for a paid subscription. And I know I know. Daddy, chill. In the intro, I said you could do everything for free. There are a lot of free alternatives out there. However, in my opinion, none as good as this one. I would suggest the basic subscription if you are just starting out. This will cost $29 per month and will give you 60 voices and 2 hours of generation every month. Or if you are really serious, you could also double the amount of generation with the pro version for $39 per month. Then, you also get access to the full 120 voices. If you pay for the whole year in one go, you get a 33% discount. I have put the link to this tool in the description, along with all the other tools used in this video. Some of these links are affiliate links, which means I could get a small fee if you decide to buy something. This won't affect the price for you, but you will help me make more of these videos for you. Alright, let's move on. Next, we want to go back to Adobe Express, and I'm going to look for a teenage boy to play the role of the sun. Perfect, a bored teenager. Now, it's very important to change the background to the green color. I will show you why in a minute. Upload the voice, and we are done. Let's have a listen. Um, Dad? Dad? I, um... Alright, I'm going to do the same for the father. Let's look for a suitable character. For my scene, I actually only need the head. You will see why later in the video. Again, upload the voice and hit download. Okay, for the background, I'm going to use Canva. I actually only need three settings. One for the intro, one where we see the sun, and one where we see the father. Let's look for a house to show where the scene is taking place. Put a road in front of the house a lovely background, and maybe a tree. A nice feature of Canva is that it also has a lot of animations you can use. Let's, for instance, put a bird in there. Select the three sliders on the right and choose Animated. Now Canva will only show animated elements. Not quite what I'm looking for. Okay. This I can work with. Now, on to the next scene. This is taking place in the living room. Let's search for a room and put in a couch. In this scene, the father is reading a book and the son is trying to get the father's attention. We are looking at the back of a chair where the father is sitting. Let's create something ourselves. Add some hair and look for a book. Again, 
let's use something animated to bring the scene to life. Now, I only need an arm, and this scene is done. For the last scene, we are looking at the father sitting in the chair. I will need two parts, the chair itself and two arms holding a book. You will see how I'm using this in a moment. Now go to CapCut. This is an amazing free editing tool. Let's upload all the pieces we have made and now let the puzzle begin. I could make a whole video about the process, so I will show you just a few key parts for making this video. However, let me know in the comments if you want a more in-depth video on how I made this. And while you're at it, please like and subscribe. The more likes I get, the more videos I'm able to make. For the intro, I want a zoom effect on the house. You can do this by going to video in the top right corner, then go to basic, and select a key frame at the part where you want the zoom to start. Then drag the timing bar to the part where you want the zoom to end. Enlarge the video, and again hit add key frame. Nothing grabs more attention like a zoom on a house. What a visual roller coaster. Now, the most important part. We want to incorporate the animations we made in Adobe. Place them over the background. And again, go to video in the top right corner. Now, go to cutout and select chroma key. Click on the color picker and select the green background color. Now, increase the strength until the green color disappears. It's as easy as that. The last feature I'm going to show you is that CapCut has a large collection of free sound effects you can use. For instance, there's also the sound of someone turning the page of a book. How convenient. Let's have a listen. Um, Dad? Dad? We are on to something. I'm going to fast forward. However, this is how the end result looks in CapCut. Now, let's take a look at the final animation. And bear in mind, this is the first animation that I have ever made in my entire existence, and it only took me about two hours. Enjoy! Welcome back to the Dad and Son Show. In this episode you will see Ethan, the son, try to tell his dad, Gary, a special secret. And oh boy, is he in for a treat. Um, Dad? Dad? Hmm? I, um, I have an imaginary girlfriend. Hmm? Um, what do you mean, you have an imaginary girlfriend? Well, it's not that I can't find a real girlfriend. It's just that having an imaginary girlfriend gives me the freedom to explore relationships and understand what it means to have someone special in my life without the pressures and complications that come with real relationships. Hmm. You can definitely do better. Oh, wow. Thanks. That makes me feel a lot better. Oh, I'm sorry. I was talking to your imaginary girlfriend. The Dad and Sun Show. See you next time.